Hello YouTube fam, how y'all doing? This is your Uncle Tim. This is Uncle Tim Rants and Reviews, the channel where I ran and I review. Fam, you know what? I've been doing this channel for a minute. One thing I learned from this channel is to listen to the subscribers. That's why I started the group over on Facebook. I learned to check in and see what they got, talk to them about it. And they've been telling me to hit up the targets. So I hit up target and I seen some stuff, man. You know, like I told you, I seen the X-Men 97s. I seen the DC Multiverse Animated. I seen uh, some DC Multiverse stuff, some Marvel Legends, some G.I. Joe Classifieds, but the NECA and every damn thing else. But I chose G.I. Joe Classified when I seen it because I was like, damn, you know, at one location they had a Viper, but man, you know what? Somebody else was grabbing it. So that was off limits, man. So I seen a, man, I seen a Tiger Force um, G.I. Joe Flint. And man, the box looked crispy as hell. It looks amazing, man. I picked them up and I was just happy to pick them up, man. And I was like, wow, damn. And this is number 89, man. And I'm like, man, I didn't think I'd see these out in a while. So, and let alone on a Target shelf. You know, I didn't think they would be there. You know, I thought as soon as this hit, they had two out. Only got this one. You know. Only got this one. And I thought this one would be good. And you know what? To be honest, this is an easy troop bill figure. But at the price that it is at like $25, I ain't trying to troop bill for $25, man. I'm just keeping that real. Next figure that they had, which, you know, I'm going to talk to you about in some detail. They have... Uh, Something that I was really looking at. G.I. Joe Classified Series. Cobra Crimson Viper. And I got two of them. Man. One thing I'm going to tell you about this figure, man. If you look at the back. Not both boxes are crispy. One is crispy and one is not. Um, again, my figures are not kept inside of boxes and things like that. My figures are, you know, taken out the box. If you look at the front, this looks amazing. Look at the weapons, the accessories, just everything that comes with it. The color that's on the box. It seemed like they got the art on the box is much better, even though you're not able to see the figure, but the boxes look fantastic. It's just like everything in there is just looking crazy. You know, it's just all up to par. You know, you're making everything to try to work, man. And like I said, Lately, things have really been falling into place. You know, if you look at the weapons on uh, Flint, man, his weapons look more better, more better. His weapons look better than they did the first time around. Again, you got some quality figures, man. Again, we're dealing with some good stuff lately, you know. I've been trying to make everything work, man. Trying to find a good deal. And lately, we have found good deals. <laughs> man, we found some good deals here, man. And I got to look at all of that. Man. Yeah. I know a lot of y'all like, boy, Unc, I know your wallet hurt. I know your wallet is screaming. I'm going to tell you something. And I'm going to be honest. Sometimes it does and sometimes it don't. You know, the biggest thing that I look at is, man, you're going to spend money on whatever it is you want. And my thing is, if you're going to get the stuff you want, make sure it's the stuff that you actually want. Not you just getting random merchandise, man. Like I said, you know, when I first started this, you know, I, I troop build the figures that I could get. I troop build it uh, Breaker, uh, Barbecue, uh, Lady J. Uh, Flint, because, you know, they had those in abundance, man. And when I bought lots of G.I. Joe Classified when I first started this, man, they always had a Flint in them, man. So that was the big thing right there. So, man, you know, with all of that being said, man, it's just a lot of stuff jumping out at you, man. Man, it's just real, man. And I just want you all to understand and see where I'm coming from, man, because, you know, collecting as a whole has changed and we are getting into a new uh, era. 
you know, whereas, you know, we can get rid of all the negative people and just keep on going, man. And right now, man, when you find and stuff, you know, even people who normally say they don't find nothing, find stuff, man. You know, I'm like, damn, you know, that's what we're doing right now. Yes, I have a, what is that? A vampire Superman coming. Now, you know what the price is in the store. You know what it is. I think after everything, you know, I think, I think I paid like $32 for it, you know, because brand new, you know, it's like 29 after taxes and all that free shipping. So I think I paid 32 for it. So I'm not mad at that. To me, it's a deal, you know, got some stuff coming, man. It's all up at what it is need to be, man. You know, I'm just happy with it, man. Just happy with what we got. It could be better. But shit, we both know it could be worse. <laughs> but to later, fam, thank you for watching. Peace out.